Hello. Alright. Um, I've already recorded this video three times. The first time I didn't hit record. The second time I got too excited and rambled and jambled and it was ten minutes long. I'm trying not to do both of those things. Okay. So tonight, um, Jen took down my nipple grafts. Um, and they are beautiful. They are certainly oval shaped. Um, my angry nipple, um, gave us a bit of a, uh, challenge. Um, basically what you have is you have gauze that's wrapped up. Um, I'm assuming it's open, stitched to your nipple, folded up, and tied in. So it's kind of going to open like a flower. Yeah, it didn't actually work out like that. Um, we ended up cutting bits of the foam off and snipping around. Anyways, it was a long, tedious process. Um, but as it happened, um, we got glimpses of the nipple and we were so excited. I mean, and then I decided that I should probably let Jen know that they're not going to be pretty in pink. Um, they are going to look dead and angry. Um, don't be surprised, guys, when your nipples do look like this. Um, they told me this in the clinic. Um, in my pre-op meeting, um, but I kind of lost track of that little statement of your nipples are going to look dead. Um, remembered it as the grafts were coming off, stopped everything, told Jen, she was like, okay, all right, let's do this. So yeah, we got into it. Um, they look great. Before we took off the nipple grafts, however, we took off the tape that was over the incisions. My incisions are terrific. They look beautiful. They're really happy. They're nice pink. A little bit of puffiness um, over here. Um, we've got two different ends happening here. On this side, we have an upwards curl, kind of like a joker smile, um, which looks really good. It's nice, smooth edges. Um, great incisions all the way along. Scarring already starting to happen. Looks terrific. Um, over here, we have a bit of a dog ear. Um, I'm not worried about it. Um, I still have a little bit of swelling going on, so once the swelling goes down, um, it, it might go down then. Um, I'm also going to start testosterone in spring, um, so, um, you know, my chest will fill out, upper body strain, things like this. That, just time, time heals it. Um, I could also get a revision, but I've already spent enough. You know, I'm, I've got a flat chest, guys. I'm not worried about a little dog ear under my arm. You know, maybe later when, you know, the high of having a flat chest wears off, maybe then I'll be like, ah, well, I got a dog ear, but whatever. Um, yeah, so incisions are terrific and nice. Um, we put some Polysporin Fast Heal on the exposed part of the incision. Um, I'm gonna continue to wear um, the, the padding with the compression compression vest that I told you about in the last video. Now this they give you right after surgery. Um, some days it's the best thing in the world, some days it's the worst, some days I'm just like what the fuck am I doing? I thought I was done binding. Um, but you know what? It feels good. It's a little bit of a comfort. So I'll take it. Um, what else? Um, yeah, this was my angry nipple. He was a... Uh, oh, uh, he was a little angrier. He's darker with some red, um, really dark brown with some red in the middle. Um, this one is a l uh, like still dark brown, but a healthier shade of brown and uh, some nice edges. Um, neither of which are completely adhered to um, my chest wall yet, um, but they're doing really good. Um, now, one thing you should know about your nipple grafts are there's two types of stitching happening here. Um, you have um, stitching, if this is your nipple, you have stitching that goes around it all and holds the gauze to it. And you also have, um, like in the case of a keyhole, um, they talk about what's called a purse string suture. Now, you have that as well with this. Um, so it's basically a, a stitching that goes all the way around it and is holding it tightly. Um, so what we did tonight was we took the, the nipple grafts off, um, but because we were a little, you know, we're doing a little early here, like, 
Um, they told me to do it at nine days, and I think we're at eight. I think we're at eight days. Um, so yeah, I jumped the gun a little on it, but you know what? I've been healing very well. Um, everything feels very healthy. Um, Jen's opinion was taken into consideration. She said everything looks healthy as well. Um, so what we did was we took out the graft stitches, so the stitches that go around, but we left in the purse string suture that goes all the way around. Um, so that'll just keep keep everything in place until everything's a, a bit better healed. Um, overall, everything looks fantastic. So good. I'm so happy. I'm so pleased. Um, I'm so happy.